I probably wouldn't recommend it. I heard some chat in here, the girls love it. Okay, let's begin charms. Okay. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. All right. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? I have no idea. Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. <laughs> mm. Okay. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, mm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? No. Hmm? Mm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. How does someone forget how to use Axia? Let's learn this. Axio. Accio. Oh, Accio as well. Accio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Mm-hmm. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Practical lesson outside. I was not expecting that. Where is he taking us to, though? Ah. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? So why don't we have our newest students start us off, hmm? Eh? 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 <laughs> what do we have to do here? Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing... Let me try this. Up, you are summoned... And then I... Oh, oh, God. No, 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 no. 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 Don't lose your composure. Okay. Well, first time, okay? First time, I didn't know I... I had to let it go. Okay. Let me try again. Excellent control there. 30 points. Okay. Very good. Okay, I got it. Okay. Not too difficult. It's not too difficult. What now? Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. Yes. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. 
Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Okay. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay, let's... We're gonna go for a little challenge with... Natsu? Natsu. Hey, See what she... Oh! Okay. 50, huh? Alright. No problem. I can I do can. that. Come on. I did it. I did it. Haha. <laughs> That's it. Here we go. Oh. 30. Okay. That is how it's I can done. get another. I can get another 50. Let's try again. Stop. Stop. Stop right there. There we are. Nicely done. Watch this. Oh. Well, now I need to. I need to either get a a thirty or a fifty. I'm gonna try a fifty. Stop! Stop! No! 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 Stop! 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 stop, stop. Got score. it! Ha! Ah. Remarkable! I won. Okay, a hundred and fifty. I hope those are points for Ravenclaw. Let's make this a bit more interesting, shall we? More interesting? Okay. Let's see what you just did. <laughs> oh. I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round okay. settles it all. Now we need to avoid the, the moving boxes. Okay, I need to do some timing in here. Thank God I do have some good coordination. Let me... Let me do it on the right timing. No. And? Do I get a 50? Okay, did you see that? Excellent control there. Did you see that? Be sharp. Oh. No, 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 no. Have a look on this. Stop, 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 stop. Yes. Quite impressive. A hundred points. You won't be able to. Here we go. You won't be able to match that. Yes. Unfortunately, you're, yeah, I won. Even if I... If I miss the next one, I, I won. But I'm not gonna miss it. 150 again. Two perfect rounds. You're a natural. 150 points. Full Ravenclaw. That's what I'm talking about. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Okay. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Um, I'm glad you understand. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Oh. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Her mother is the divination teacher. Okay. And Waga Wagadu is the, the school of magic of Uganda? Is that it? Uh, what does Wagadu look like? Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. 
I remember the first time I saw it. The mist was so thick, I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. <laughs> it sounds nice. I've never heard of that, of that school of magic. Um, is magic the same? This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. What? That's... That's... That's kind of incredible. They all do wandless magic. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. <laughs> yeah, I suppose so. Quite, quite more dramatic. How big is Wagadu? Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes. Bigger than Hogwarts. Bigger? But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. How can it be bigger than Hogwarts? Wow. It must be... It must be gigantic. And you said it was carved into the, the stone. So, imagine that. How... It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah! I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. That was very interesting. That was a nice, interesting conversation. Get to know about another school. If you're so inclined. Well, a word if you'd you be would. using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. What are they talking about? Oh, they're going away. Oh. What's up with you, Slithering? Is he like ready for a fight or something with me already? Gotcha. Okay, let me speak to Ronan. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Okay, okay, we're gonna have to do extra hours, but it's fine, I guess we're gonna learn a lot of stuff pretty quickly. And what are you wanting to talk about? After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying everywhere, quite unsafe really. <laughs> the cutlery, oh my god. Okay, what about you? What do you have to share? Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. But a bit mad. Okay. Anything Rebellion. here? Anything to reveal? Oh. What is that? It, it's in another room, right? Yeah, it's in another room. Always need to check out everything. To see if I discover something and this is his office isn't it yes it's the office can't go there until we learn alohomora then we could sneak in and is there anything in the yeah there are some things in the black ball okay pretty nice detail hello how was your first day coming along um excuse me who are you? Samantha. Oh, hello again. Hello, Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. 
You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. It's going pretty good. Uh, wasn't too much of a challenging lesson anyway. <laughs> no, um, that's kind of you to say. Thank you. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Okay. Oh, what are you trying to do that? Doesn't seem to be working very well, my friend. Try not to burn the, the school down. Right. And what a nice little area we have here. Oh my god, Peeves again. Oh damn it, he's gonna break the, the busts. You're all in trouble with Professor Black! <laughs> oh god, he is just as much annoying as he is supposed to be. Okay. Oh, now I can... I can accue the pages. That's right. Okay. Pretty nice. Um... Professor Hackett is intimidating, but then she has a serious subject to teach. I love all of these common areas here for students to just sit down, enjoy the time between classes. And this looks like a sort of Ravenclawish area. We even get some... Okay, this area has an enchanted ceiling. This is what I thought they would do in a Ravenclaw common room. You can see some stars in a nebula. And then here we also have a telescope. Okay. Yeah, this seems like a nice spot for the Ravenclaws to meet up in between classes. I haven't been down to the boathouse since arriving in my first. Oh, it's writing itself right now. Look at that. Some sort of potion thing with ingredients and all of that. I wonder how many secret passages Hogwarts actually has. I stumbled on one the other day. Couldn't find my way out for hours. Missed my favorite meal I did. Kidney pie. Hogwarts always has another mystery to discover. Secret passages. You should have a look on the Marauders map. It's not around yet, is it? Well, we do have the field guide. Which sort of works the same way. Side quests are now available. Oh, interesting. Is this a side quest? No, this is this is the main quest where we need to talk with Professor Weasley. I think we're going to Hogsmeade, right? And what about the side quests? Where do I where do I find them? Where are they? Is this side quests? Yes. Okay. Pretty nice. 